Hey guys, Murloc 68. Hope everybody's doing well. I've got a 40 millimeter, 6 millimeter shackle brass body padlock. It's not branded. I'm going to hopefully try to demonstrate uh, maybe three ways, four ways to get into these uh, unbranded um, padlocks. This is a five pinner, so not bad. Feels well, uh, well built. So let's start with uh, an SPP on this thing. Five pinner. Let's see what we got. And one, two, crackle there on pin three feels weird okay yeah that's sticking a little bit there but anyways we got that open for SPP so let's try um, let's try the worm rake okay light tension on the worm rake we're just going to run it through a couple of times and there we go we got it open okay um, let's try zipping the zipping technique again light tension you want to make sure you're not binding we're already dealing with a sticky core here so I'm going to put that in give it a couple of shots and we're in Okay, let's try the L rake, and then I'll show you guys maybe some other. Uh... Okay, so there's the L rake. Um, I don't know if I can get shims in here. Let's see if we have. Let's see if we can get this open. If it's a true two pole. Uh, Okay, we've got the one shim in there. Okay, so we definitely have two poles that need to be uh, activated. I uh, don't know if I'm going to get this one in or not. I've not tried it. Oh, there we go. So we did get that in. So that's, uh, I don't know, five ways, guys, to get into these locks. Um... Well, there may be another one. Let's try to see if there's a gap here that we can shim this core. I've got shims. Try to find a half decent shim. That one's all bent. Okay, so let's see if it's guarded. If it's got that lip on it or not. Well, it does not, guys. It's not guarded. So I don't know how long this will take, but let's give it a shot. So once you got your shim in, I like to keep just a little bit of pressure on the shim and try to guide it down. Slowly. Now you can see how that shim is going, working its way down. You don't want to push down too hard on the shim. Let's see how close we are. And there we go guys, we got it open by just putting the turn tool in now. So you've bypassed it. Uh, so we've bypassed it at the core, we've uh, shimmed it on both sides, we've SPP'd it, we worm raked it, we zipped it, and we city raked it, guys. There's the key. Although all these techniques may not work on every lock, 
one or more of these will be available to you if you just study the lock a little bit and um, the shimming at the end there I, I uh, just noticed that it may not have been um, um, guarded hopefully you enjoyed that video guys some rapid entry techniques and uh, a couple of ways to get into these cheap Chinese locks stay well patience practice perseverance we'll see you at the next one